While South Africa has its fair share of women who have led exemplary lives, we also have a number of women who stand out because of the sheer horror of the crimes they committed. The list below has not been published in any particular order, since no murder can be deemed. First on our list is Joey Harhoff, who is believed to have actively participated in the kidnap, sexual assault and probable murder of at least eight girls, aged between 8 and 16 years old. The accomplice and lover of pedophile Jurt Van Rien, Joey Harhoff, played an active role in the kidnap, sexual assault and probable murder of at least eight girls across South Africa. Harhoff and Van Rien were never convicted for any of their crimes, despite a mountain of evidence against them. When one of their victims escaped in 1990, Van Rien killed Joey before committing suicide. The bodies of their victims have yet to be found. Second on our list is born on June 1, 1886, Daisy Lisa C. DeMulker was a trained nurse from Germiston, who poisoned two husbands with strychnine for their life insurance, and poisoned her only son with arsenic. While it was widely known that she had committed all three murders, Daisy was only convicted for the murder of her son. She is the second woman to have been hanged in South Africa. In 1989, our third entry Sandra Smith became the last woman to be executed in South Africa. The last woman to be hanged in South Africa, 22-year-old Sandra Smith and her boyfriend Yassine Harris, murdered Mitchell's plain schoolgirl Jermaine Abrahams on September 1, 1986, when they broke into the Abrahams' home. Smith, a married woman with two children, is believed to have been the one who committed the vicious murder, despite Harris claiming responsibility. After demanding her mother's jewelry from the terrified 16-year-old, the pair savagely attacked her, and Jermaine was stabbed repeatedly. The dying teenager begged for mercy and asked her attackers for water, but instead they stuffed a dish towel in her mouth and slit her throat. Her fourth entry is jailed for life for masterminding the shocking murder of six-month-old baby Jordan in 2005. Dina Rodriguez is probably South Africa's best-known female killer. Jealous of Jordan Lee Norton, the baby that her boyfriend Neil Wilson had with his previous girlfriend, Dina hired hitman to kill the infant in a staged house robbery. She paid Saifum Fazho, Manjezi Bobadian, Zanathem Bagwata and Banjan Kosi Sejenu a pittance to carry out the murder that catapulted her into the headlines for more than two years. Our final entry the wife of wealthy Cape Flats businessman Victor, Lindy paid two hitmen to kill her husband on December 16, 1984. The reason for the crime. According to family members Victor was an abusive husband. And his R500000 life insurance policy surely seemed like a nest egg to start a new life with. Shockingly, the murderous nurse was only prepared to fork over 500 and 800 to the two men who stabbed her husband to death. 